It's an, un it's an unbeatable combination of design, performance, and photography, all at a great value. The Google Pixel 7a is here in its full glory. Wow! The smartphone was unveiled at the 2023 Google I.O. Developer Conference. And to continue the I.O. tradition, let me show you the newest member of our A-Series. We're completely upgrading everything you love about our A-Series with the gorgeous new Pixel 7a. And it's nothing short of amazing. That's nice. With a powerful processor, AI software features, crystal clear camera system, stronger battery, and a variety of color options to choose from. The Pixel 7a is ready to battle its way to the top of the best smartphones. Let's just see what they have to tell us. Let's discuss the Google Pixel 7a today and why you must add it to your to-buy list. Let's dive right in. Except for a few of the Pixel models that were released a month after their announcement, Google mostly releases the latest model within the same month after its announcement. An example is the Pixel 6, which was announced on October 19, 2021, and released on October 28, 2021. Pixel 7 was also announced on October 6, 2022, and released the same year on July 13. Pixel users are used to this schedule of release, Therefore, there is a need for Google to change. And that is exactly what the tech company is doing with the Pixel 7a. Really? Really, really. The smartphone was announced recently during Google's I.O. event of 2023 held on May 10, and then became available for purchase on the Google online store just after its announcement. Now here's the best part. Pixel 7a is available today, starting at $499. You can also buy from your favorite retail stores, but Google offers unique color options when you purchase from them. Wondering how much you would have to pay for the 7A? We talk about it next. Taking clues from the previous models, all the A versions of the Google Pixels smartphones have had a starting price of not more than $499. Pixel's 5a, for instance, had a starting price of $449, just like the Pixel's 6a. It was quite obvious then that the 7a would follow the same trend, just like what most leaks predicted. Google is the worst company on earth at keeping things a secret, and I don't think it's on purpose. Like some people think it's an intentional leak, and oh, they're, they're letting stuff get out about their phones, so that's free press. No, I think they're just bad at it like really, really bad at it. So everything about the phone is already out before it even comes out. That's just the way it is with Pixel phones now. And truly the Pixel 7a will have a starting price of $499. Some critics say the extra $50 added to the cost of the Pixel 7a does not only make the device a bit overpriced, but also derails Google from its pricing of the Pixel's models, which it's kept consistent since Pixel 5a. It is true the 7a is more expensive than the 6a, but considering the extra functions and features the Pixel's 7a brings on board, especially its camera quality, it is fair to say a $50 addition is worth it. Very true. We talk about the camera feature of the Pixel 7a later in the video. Stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. Subscribe to our channel for the latest updates about Google smartphones and products in general. We're here to serve you with the best. Various series and models of Google Pixels have followed a particular design over the years such as the use of aluminum sides and plastic back coupled with a horizontal bar of camera setup. This design seems to have done the magic for Pixel lovers so far, hence there wasn't a need to change. Right? Yes, we love it! This year's Pixel 7a series maintains almost the same design as the Pixel 6a but with a few modifications. For example, the 7a will have a revamped mid-frame, which is to allow the device to become more durable than the previous versions. It, however, maintains the same aluminum frames, plastic back, and Corning Gorilla Glass-covered screen. The design is not the only department without improvements. The protection rating remains IP67 rating just that of the Pixel 6a. The design of the Pixel 7a might not have had any major upgrade, but the camera surely did and you're gonna love the camera. The 7A takes the crown from 6A as the highest rated camera in its class. Keep watching to know more. 
The Pixel 6 a features a pretty good lineup of specs. The processor, battery, storage, etc. The 7A had to keep up with the same specs or better still, improve upon them. Impressively, Google did not disappoint. Features Google's Tensor G2 powerhouse CPU and a Titan M2 security chip for extra data protection. In terms of storage capacity, it comes with an 8GB RAM and a non-expandable 128GB internal storage space. Like all Pixel 7 series devices, Pixel 7a is powered by our flagship Google Tensor G2 chip and it's paired with eight gigabytes of RAM, which ensures Pixel 7a delivers best-in-class performance and intelligence. Though it might be relatively small, it is quite understandable for a mid-priced phone of its sort. Battery would be kind of interesting because it's roughly the same size battery as the Pixel 7, so would it have the same battery life or not? Features 4,385 milliamp hours with an 18 watts fast charging speed that can last up to more than 10 hours when fully charged. The 6.1 inch OLED smartphone with a 90 hertz refresh rate comes with a 152 x 72.9 x 9.0 millimeters dimension and weighs 193.5 grams. It offers four color options, charcoal, sea, snow and coral, which is exclusive at Google Store. The Pixel 6a had a lot of selling features, but its camera definitely wasn't one. It came with an 8 megapixels front camera and a 12 megapixels ultra-wide camera and does not feature a telephoto sensor. This definitely did not settle well with Pixel users. Oh, that is bad. Hence, there was the need for Google to make amendments. The camera features of the Pixel 7 a does the magic this time around. It features the highest res camera in Pixel history. Not even the 50 megapixel sensor of the Pixel 7 and 7 Pro come close. According to Google, the phone's upgraded main camera features a 72% larger sensor than Pixel 6a, allowing for 44% more light. With a 64 megapixels main camera, Pixel users can now take clearer and better pictures with their cameras. It also features a 13 megapixels ultra-wide camera and a front 13 megapixels selfie sensor capable of recording 4K video at 30 frames per second. Marcus Brownlee further explains. Has a brand new 64 megapixel main camera paired with a 13 megapixel ultra-wide and a 13 megapixel selfie camera. So when I first started testing it, I mean, I'm thinking, all right, will this new sensor keep up with the old tried and true Pixel 6a? Because we all know how good those old cameras were. But pretty quickly, it became clear that Google has done the work to tighten up the processing with the new sensor and actually sort of match it this time and take advantage of the actual larger sensor. So it's not just about the megapixel count. Matter of fact, this 64 megapixel sensor bins down to 16 megapixels by default every time, and there's no way in Google's app to take full 64 megapixel photos. But it's more about the larger size of the sensor, which can bring in more light and give a more shallow, natural depth of field. What's your take on the Pixel 7a? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section below. The Pixel 7a might be getting all the attention, but did you know there is a new Google device in the market that is ready to rock heads with other big brands such as Apple and Samsung? I'm talking about the all-new Google Pixel tablet. We cover all you need to know about the device in the next video. Do well to watch and see you next time. If you liked it, please don't forget to subscribe below.